Hello everyone, this is Gotech Grad with another video. This is a demo of the first milestone of a new game I am creating and designing called Tetra City. As you complete lines along with special blocks, your city will grow. Tetra City is an idea I came up with last weekend. It is basically a combination of Tetris and SimCity. I have been making games since the early 90s when I used QBasic on my 386. Since that time I have learned and developed projects in many other languages such as Java, C, C++, Smalltalk, and Perl. I have done game programming using libraries such as SDL, Allegro, ClanLib, and Java Aut and Swing. For this project I decided to use Ruby since it is one of the hottest new languages today. I have done little Ruby programming so this has given me a good opportunity to learn the language. When choosing the development language I was somewhat inspired by Frozen Bubble which proved that complex games using 3D rendering can be created in non-compiled scripting language. The first milestone I set was to create a fully functioning Tetris game which uses OpenGL to achieve the best frame rate. As I found out while I was developing Legend of Tux, OpenGL must be used to achieve a frame rate over 30 frames per second at 1024 by 768 resolution which pushes the graphics processing to the graphics processor or graphics card instead of running on your main CPU. As you can see in this demo, the Tetris game I have developed is running on the left. I learned that using a call to GL Ortho allowed me to develop the Tetris game using a standard XY coordinate system. On the right side, I added an area to display a 3D rendering. Currently, it is just a spinning cube. However, in the next milestone, that area will be a 3D representation of your city. For more information on the design and development of Tetra City, please see the project website at www.tetracity.net forward slash wiki. There is even a link to the SourceForge repository so you can check out the Ruby code.